afternoon, everybody. We are gonna go ahead and get started with our final ribbon cutting of 2022. Oh my gosh. You're the, you're the lucky recipient of that, Brad. Yes, that doesn't get them anything extra the yeah. <laughs> Oh, I think it's going to give him a tax abatement. Oh, wow. <laughs> so, well, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. I'll take it. So, uh, for those of you that I've not met, I'm Kimberly Marshall with the City of Medina. I'm the Economic Development Director. And I'm super excited about this ribbon cutting today because Brad Jr. and Brad Sr., we've been working on this project for several years now. And um, so it's been an interesting journey. Um, this company actually uh, was located in one of our surrounding townships and needed to expand and they've been out looking for a property or a building and and then they temporarily ha temporarily housed down on Lake Road until they could get this uh, facility uh, built uh, which is just so it's almost 12,000 square feet and they've hired 13 people already and uh, about another five to six more to go. Um, we, so I know you probably know some of this stuff, Brad, but we put the ribbon cuttings together with the Medina Chamber of Commerce and Jacqueline Links Myers, executive director, and then also Main Street Medina. George Sam could not be here today as a funeral to go oh. to. So, and then <clears throat> when we first met, we were out at the Medina County Economic Development Bethany's office and over there on Broadway. I don't remember oh that. Gosh. That was like a long time oh ago, gosh, yes. Yeah. Well, Bethany also wanted to be here today, but um, mm -hmm. she had a family matter to take oh. care of, but she wanted me to pass on her um, congratulations. Thanks. So, um, but anyways, so we've been working on this project for a really long time, so it's super exciting to see it to come, come to fruition. And we thank you so much for choosing Medina, because obviously you have choices, and um, we appreciate the investment and the job growth, and I think you're going to do really well here. So um, we have uh, several of our uh, administrative team with us today. Some of our council members are here. So I'm going to turn it over to our mayor, Dennis Hanwell, to say a few words. Thanks, Kimberly. So we'd like to welcome everybody uh, as well. Um, jo joining me in addition to, uh, to Kimberly, our uh, council members, uh, Paul Rose, council at large, which is the entire city of Medina. We have two at large, one council president, four wards, and uh, Councilman Denny Simpson to my right here is in the northeast quadrant of the city. And we appreciate both both of them uh, being here and supporting uh, the economic development efforts of, of, of the city. Uh, from the administrative team, uh, in addition to uh, Kimberly and myself, our uh, Andrew Dutton, who's our community development director, uh, Dan Gladish is our chief building official. I know you worked a lot with Dan, you know, during the process as as the contractors have, have shared with me. Um, our police chief Ed Kinney. Uh, and our fire chief, uh, Larry Walters. Uh, we also have uh, Matt from Medina TV. Um, we'll provide you this video for, for your own marketing use. And uh, Barbara Dezer is the marketing director for economic development and all the still photos she takes, uh, we, we will also provide uh, to you uh, for, for the same purpose. Do we miss any administrative folks? Mm -hmm. Okay, and Sarah is here from uh, the Medina Gazette. We always appreciate the Gazette coming out. Sir, I take it, are you with media as well? Yes. Okay, which paper? Is Moving it? Out Magazine. Moving yeah. Out Magazine? It's a newspaper for truckers. Yes, sir. Okay, well, we appreciate you being here too. You're welcome. Thank you for the marketing we can here, right? <laughs> so, we, we have um, a proclamation here uh, on behalf of the Medina City Council and the City of Medina, and I'm going to uh, read and present this to you. It says, City of Medina Proclamation in recognition of the ribbon cutting of Trailer One Incorporated. Whereas Trailer One Incorporated is celebrating its ribbon cutting in Medina on Friday, December 9th, 2022. And whereas Trailer One Incorporated is a semi-trailer sales, leasing, and rental business specializing in dry vans, flatbeds, drop decks, reefers, and specialty trailers. And whereas Trailer One Incorporated will contribute to the local quality of life 
and help pro to provide a foundation for a strong, diversified economic base in the city of Medina. And whereas the city of Medina is honored to officially welcome Trailer One Incorporated to Medina and grateful they have chosen to open their business here, we look forward to the great things that Trailer One Incorporated will accomplish in the future. And now therefore, on behalf of the Medina City Council and City of Medina, I, Dennis Hanwell, Mayor of the City of Medina, do hereby recognize Trailer One Incorporated on its ribbon cutting and offer sincere best wishes for many years of success. And I've affixed the seal of the City of Medina and signed it this ninth day of December, 2022. Congratulations. <laughs> We also have from a number of uh, elected officials and representatives that were not able to make it, I'll present them individually. The first is from the uh, Board of Medina County Commissioners and it's signed by Steve Hambly, uh, Commissioner Bill Hudson and Commissioner Colleen Swedick. And um, this is a certificate of congratulations on the opening of Trailer One. <laughs> And our uh, Secretary of State, Frank LaRose, uh, a certif certificate of commendation uh, on opening your new business. Treasurer Robert Sprague. The uh, Treasurer of the State of Ohio, a uh, congratulatory letter. Uh, on the opening, grand opening of Trailer One uh, by Robert Sprague. Okay. And last but not least, a letter of congratulations from uh, U.S. Senator Rob Portman. Uh, generally, one of his aides can, can attend. Uh, they were not able to today, so they ask us to present this on, the, on their behalf. <laughs> We also uh, generally have our, our Ohio House of Representatives, Sharon Ray, uh, attends these with us, and she was not able to make it today, and she will either send directly to you, or if she sends it to City Hall, we'll get it out here for you uh, on behalf of the Ohio House of Representatives, another certificate. So thank you so God, much. God bless and congratulations. Thank you very much. I think <laughs> Shannon probably <laughs> has a plan as well. Yeah. So Shannon is already delegating. <laughs> well, we have a little joke on the Ribbon Hike Trail, which is we're from the government. We can't even have a party without paperwork. <laughs> the nicest part of paperwork that you'll ever receive. So. It is beautiful. Thank you guys so very much. Yeah, absolutely. Um, so we're going to turn it over to you. Okay. And your dad. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm just a pretty face. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> the the bulk of the recognition really goes to my dad and Brad Thomas, and also his partner who couldn't be here today, Ken Smith, who started Trailer One 33 years ago, 1989, yep. and uh, uh, just grit their teeth and. and and, and worked hard to, to build it up to what it has become today. Uh, and then, you know, thanking everybody here for coming without our vendors and customers. I mean, we wouldn't be in existence or be here today. Um, from, you know, the very beginning, the city, Mr. Hanwell, everybody that we've worked with with the city has been over the top helpful in getting this together. Uh, Key Bank, uh, who financed the property, First National Bank, who, who has been our primary bank for a number of years that helped us out and, and gotten us through some difficult times. Uh, to, thanks to uh, uh, our builder, Joe, at Wooster Buildings, our excavation crew in Schrock Excavating and uh, Landscaping with Mueller, Mueller Landscaping. Um, but really the the, the uh, real hard work is done by everybody that works and 
not so much myself, but uh, <laughs> uh, Chris Schuster has been with us for 19 years now. Uh, 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 Shannon Harvey, uh, George Alocution, Jerry Gugliotta. Uh, 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 now I'm blanking because I'm <laughs> Yeah, Mike Rudolph, and we've added uh, a handful of uh, uh, shop guys help us out, and Jason, Tom, and Ralph, uh, our driver, Joe. Uh, why am I? And, uh, <laughs> but between, it's the, it's the group of them that really put this into motion and get they, they're the gears that keep this thing rolling and they're the ones who deserve the recognition just the same you know oh, I agree. Um, but thank you again all everybody for coming uh, you know. <laughs> Yeah, well, and my girlfriend, who's put up with me for the last, <laughs> she deserves probably oh, patience. <laughs> <laughs> and, and she made the, the great recommendation to write something down, and, and I sure didn't. <laughs> I, 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 I regretted it more than, more than you know. <laughs> but I think all kidding aside, though, you commended a lot of people, but you didn't commend yourself enough. Because you've been Absolutely. involved in this from the very beginning, yeah. and you traveled all over looking at other facilities to put together some best practices. The man put a heated floor in next door, right? <laughs> and is using the tankless hot water system. You're nailing it. <laughs> okay, everybody look up and smile. And go three, two, one. All right. All right.